Previously on Survivor. The second day was coming to an end, and the castaways competed in a tournament style challenge, where Sean came out on top. Back at camp, the vote appeared to be between Becca and Meg, but before the tribe could go to tribal, the rain made it so the vote would have to take place early the next morning. Come back tomorrow morning, it's gonna be early. During the night, a bond between Katie, Elena, Becca, Luke, and Sean was made, resulting in the target focusing in on Meg. Even with Becca throwing a vote on Luke. This new bond was too much to overcome, and Meg was sent home. Meg, the tribe is voting. Seven are left. Who will be voted out tonight? That last vote, I was like, what's going to be? Yeah. 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 What the fuck was Becca doing voting for Luke? She's such a wild card. I think Becca voted. Yeah, Becca voted. Yeah, Becca voted. I don't think. Yeah. Yeah. I think, you know, I think Sean's trying to throw in. I think he is, but he seems like yeah. he's like a squid. I, I don't understand why she was at Luke Hill because he came up to me this morning and he goes, we're still running back, right? Yeah, that's what he said to me too. That's why. I actually told Tracy before the vote that we were voting Meg because I didn't want her to be blindsided. I'm really trying for better jury management this year. Um, so I just can't do blindside after blindside. Yeah, if he doesn't get a new idea, I think we really going to have a big talk about it. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think he's I've been down. I've yeah. been down. I think that's what we said the first vote. Mm -hmm. So, so we would take him and make him a key. Chill with him. You know how to do it. He's one of them. I'm learning to not trust Katie though. Yeah. So now, I'm kind of targeting Becca. And Sean. Because, like, I mean, I, I, mean I, I mean, I already told him. I was like, I want a crazy situation to happen. If we three, had, or all four of us voted, and then it was Ty, then it would have been Meg and Lou, and then who the fuck knows what happened from there. And it's like something hasn't happened like that yet in the game. And so it's like, that would be a good pivotal moment. That's just what I was thinking. It's not just because I'm like, fuck Luke. That vote was kind of shitty. Um, so I know that Lexi, Tracy, and Meg were not trusting me, but um, also now I put something on Luke because I was just hoping that something would happen um, because I mean, they literally didn't have the numbers to vote me out. I don't know if they talked to other people and they were just like, no, because we're all voting together for those five people that were in that car. Um, which I'm like, fuck, maybe I shouldn't have done that. But I did want something crazy to happen. Um, you know, there's a bigger cross on my back now. Um, but I think Katie and I are still really close. And I, I mean, I blatantly told Luke, I was like, I voted for you and this is why. And I think he, he respects the game. I was just like, who the fuck was she? <laughs> <laughs> it was me. Well, that's what, so I've gotten like a bunch of votes now, and it's always one vote, and it's always like the first one pops up, I'm like, ooh, what the hell? Honestly, Becca throwing a vote on me was like the greatest thing, because I think it kind of just made it look not as much like a group of five, 
to Tracy as it actually was. I don't know why Becca thought voting me was the right thing to do, but I think it worked out for me in the long run. I gotta just make it through one more vote and I'm in final four and I feel like if I'm in final four with Elena, Tracy and Sean, I've got such a good shot at being in the end and I think I've got a really good shot at winning and I'm starting to think about what my speech will be. Here's the thing, like, Elena should have won my season. We should have treated her as a former winner and we didn't. Right. Like, I think it's just because everyone likes her. Like, like she is more dangerous than Joey ever was. Right. I think... I think she has to win this. Yeah. yeah. If it's not Sean. Do you think, so So you need Becca, obviously. Do you think you could get Sean? Sean? Yeah, okay. I don't think you bring in Luke. You can't bring in Luke. I was gonna ask for Tracy. I don't think we should, right? She's just trying to stay with them. Like yeah. they, the three of them have been talking yeah. to them. Yeah, the three of them are super tight. Lexi has not done what she said she will for two, week, two votes in a row, so I think that'll be a true test of like, like she keeps saying like, yes, I wanna work with you, so. And I do think now she realizes that she's on the bottom and I'm like, I've been trying to pull her in, so I'm hoping that that like works, but we'll see. We gotta call Elena. Mm-hmm. I think. Okay. Yeah. She's I really think, I mean, yeah. cause I'm like, I think I am too, but like, if, I, she's, she's running it. Yeah. I mean, the thing is she's playing both sides, we're playing mm -hmm. one side. I think Elena is playing like all people, like she's playing all sides. She told Tracy that she was going to vote Meg. She said she just like flipped on the way up, but like clearly she didn't like because Luke didn't do it either. So I think that'll be an interesting dynamic because I've seen Tracy, Luke and Elena talking a lot. We should have been treating her the formal way the entire time, and yes. we didn't. And I, I mean, I brought that up to Meg. I was like, dude, we got to vote out Elena. And they were like, it's not the time. I was like, no because it's because I was like, but all of you guys are going to be voted it's out because everybody likes it. I know. That's why. It's and true. it's like, see, that's why I have We need one there. more person to vote. Sean. Yeah. I don't know what we can do. I think it's potentially salvageable. Yeah. Um, I'm, li I'm, I'm listening. <laughs> yeah. So. Like, Luke and Elena are closer right. than any of them and me. Right. Luke and Elena are close. Tracy and Elena are close. Katie and Elena are close. Elena and Tracy are close because I'm a worse person to carry forward than Tracy. Yeah. Katie and Elena have been talking about. We can maybe convince Tracy that she hasn't done anything. So, like, a big foot move from her is necessary for her to even be considered. Yeah. I think that's necessary. And then Becca and Katie could get on board. All right, first thing first, John, I'll take it back. All right, so for your first challenge of today, you're going to be tested mentally and physically. It's only appropriate. You're going to start here, leaving this table without looking at your paper. You're going to run around the fenced area to that piece of paper over there. There's 26 signs with 20 numbers underneath them. You're going to have to memorize all 20, come back and match the number to the symbol. Um, first person to get it done wins immunity. You can take as many trips as you want. Um, you're going to be running around this way and you're going to be coming back the same way. Just 20? 20, just 20. 20 so symbols. Do we run first and then go or do we get some paper You do not look at the paper first. Okay. Survivor's ready. Go. Ow! Behind the log. I think we're going to stay behind the log, Tracy. Oh, I'm sorry.
six, graveyard three, but not. P11 is going. That was the way to do it. That was the way to do it. Yeah. Dude, that was the fucking nice. way to do it. What'd you do? We partnered up together. Yeah. I was like, can we do that? You know when? Yeah. Good job. Dude, holy shit. Thank you for working that way. I was so that fucking close. Perfect. You I knew, I knew it and I was like, I thought it wasn't. I was like, fuck, it's either 15 or 5. Yeah. That's, wow. I'm, yeah, I'm happy that you guys did that. And now it's done. Did you just get it by yourself, basically? I have one last year. Oh, shit! Congratulations, Elena. Thank you. You're the only one safe. Yeah. Good. Good job. That was really good. You have a one in six shot at winning this game. The rest of you, yeah. not so lucky. Grab your things and back to camp. I mean, but you were speed was not helping. Yeah. Doesn't help. Doesn't help. Doesn't help. Sucks. Becca worked with me so I could win the immunity challenge. Like, <laughs> what? So I won and she didn't, and now she's in danger. Like, I'm not good at puzzles. I want to win that. Like, yes. Yeah. No matter what I did in the world, I can never win that challenge. Mm -hmm. And I knew it. And I knew it before, and I knew it. Like, it's gonna burn me. It's burned me last time. I'm nervous yet again after not winning the immunity ch challenge. Um, I just couldn't remember anything and everyone knows that I can't remember things. I can run all I want but didn't help in that one, especially with the girls teaming up. That was, that was a smart play on them. I'm happy, I'm like, I'm happy that he didn't win but if they don't use this, I think it would, I just would laugh at that point though because it's just like, just you're just being stupid. Like, yeah. I will vote for Sean. Yeah, like, it's like we're literally saying we're voting for Sean. And they're, no, no, but like, they're like, if I'm on the, if they vote me out no. and I'm on the jury, I'm going to be like, Sean. Like, yeah. yeah. Genuinely feel good about it, like you. Yeah. I genuinely feel good about what we have. Yeah. I think Tracy and Luke are like diehard, like, like loyal. Yes. So I was talking no, about Sean. Yeah. How, so and he was like, Something. And I was like, okay. And he was like, there may or may not be an idol in play. So I don't know if he's fucking with me or not. Okay. It might be that he's fucking with you. But, yeah. so, okay. That's weird that he said that. <laughs> he hasn't said anything like that to me. People are real worried about Sean. Um, people are real worried about Becca. Um, frankly, I think I'm more worried about Sean. Um, he lied to me this morning. He lied to Luke last night. He said some weird 
stuff to me one-on-one -on -one today about maybe having an immunity idol, but it's Sean, so I don't know if he's just messing with me or not. The thing is, if we do get Sean out right now, I feel like you and Elena now become the target, and it's three versus three, and way more fishy stuff could happen. You're right. Whereas, like, let's, right. Say, let's say he just plays his idol today because he thinks he's going home, and it's four on Becca, three on him. The idol's gone. We're still in the power position because we have four, they only have two, and then, then we can pull the two of them and we take out Sean and his idols not in play. Mm -hmm. The worst case scenario is that I just don't think taking Sean out right now is the best move because you, me, okay. and Elena are then out in the open. Me, Sean, Tracy, and Elena are sticking together to vote out Becca. So, with Becca or Lexi, I think it's Marvel's too. Yeah, I think Becca's more of a threat. Becca? Like, I'm just stupid. Okay, yeah, cool. Let's do Becca. Cool. Four of us are fucking tight, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah fucking solid. tight. Yeah. Run Becca. Yeah. We're in the fucking end game after that. This is the last book that I personally need to get through to make it to Final Four, so I definitely don't think it's me. I think if anything, it's Sean. If it's someone from our group, but I don't think our group is wavering at all. I don't think Tracy's in on it. She was all about Sean at first, but we just talked to her and she doesn't seem to be anymore. I don't think Sean's gonna flip because Sean's best bet is to work with me, Elena, and Tracy, and then me and Elena are definitely tight. So I mean, I'm just gonna tell you, I don't need to be involved. You guys have something. I'm just gonna, if you don't get Sean out, Sean's gonna win. Yeah. Like, I, Sean makes me nervous. Yeah. He's right there. Like I'll see. Like if I'm on the jury, he's got my vote. Yeah. So I'm just I mean, gonna put that on. He's right. playing the best name is one two. I'm telling Elena straight up, if you vote out one of us three, Sean's gonna win. Like, he, you have not played a better game than him. That's like, not an, like, an impressive strategy or anything that's gonna get you to win. This is what, you, they probably have all said this. Mm -hmm. They're probably all trying to do this for each other, like all three of us. So we're like, honestly, if you vote one of us out right now, and we don't vote Sean out. Mm -hmm. I'm saying this right, but I yeah, literally no, just told you that. Um, it's like, it's a bad look on everyone who doesn't vote out Sean because us three are going to vote for Sean. Mm -hmm. If we, if Who's us three? Um, Lexi, Katie, and I. I am scared shitless, as I should be, I think. Um, so I've brought up so many different things with the team. Um, I brought up Sean, obviously, and I told all of them that if Sean doesn't get voted out, that Lexi... Um, Katie and I will be voting for Sean if he makes it to far nail three as the winner because he deserves it. My thing is that's kind of flawed because if I keep Sean around now, then Katie will be going after Sean no matter what because she doesn't want to sit next to him in the final. And it's like what he's saying is more sense. I'm just hoping Sean doesn't win immunity next. So things we have, we'll have. Yeah. I would be shocked if you don't. There's no way he's going to make it to the final three. No, no, there's no way. The goal is, at the end of the day, to get me, Luke, and Elena to final tribal. This is the squad. This, this is, is the final My ideal final three is me, Lexi, and Tracy. There's a lot of different things that could happen. Like, my name is definitely getting tossed around. The minority is trying to swing one of us over to either vote out me or Luke, I think. I mean, if you want to say, be the I know you don't want to say yes, but I want you to say yes, just so. <laughs> I vote for Luke right now. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I think like, like right now. Like, we're going to be his loss. Like, it's, it's up to you, right? And it's like, also, if he hasn't hidden me in there, one of us, one of our names is up the line. Whoever they vote for, it's going to be us. So, so it's not you. It's not you. You know that right yeah. now in this moment. I know. So. If you vote one, it us, would be a move. We, I mean, um, also, it would be something to differentiate you us from know. them because, yeah. as yeah. Being, especially you, have been doing the same thing as Elena and Luke so far. So I think they're going to try to differentiate themselves pretty soon. And I don't think this. Is I also, think this is a good time. We're not using you as a bodyguard. I also you. do think it's like it's a good move for me. Like, like yeah. you need a move. Yeah. Yeah. Like, this, is, yeah. this is the fucking. Move. No, like yeah, it's good for us know, to vote Luke out right now, but, but it's good for you too. Yeah. Do you think you? No, 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 I'm not even kidding. I'm why, not why would we yeah. not? Because I'm like, she I could have won be that, she won that, that's the issue. I'm like, I don't, she would be yeah. all for it, you know? Yeah. 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 Dude. Dude. Yeah. I mean, granted, it's yeah. not. I mean, you can check on it. <laughs> You're going to go through? All right.
Let's fucking do yes. it. Let's fucking do it. Alright, fucking I'm in. Do it. Okay. I'm in. Dude, we're fucking. Let's not fuck around. Alright. Let's not fuck around. We'll put lips in your mouth. Absolutely. We need it. You need it. Now bringing in the members of the jury. Mike, Shannon, Eric, and Meg voted out at the last travel council. All right, last challenge, it was hard to miss that Elena, Lexi, and Becca, you all worked together. So Elena, you're the one wearing the necklace. What was the lot or thinking behind you three working together? Uh, we just thought we had a better chance against the more physical people if we work together. We didn't discuss who was going to win. Um, I actually thought Becca was going to win. She made it back to the table before me. She just accidentally messed up the next two numbers and I happened to remember them. Becca, Elena mentioned the more physical people. Who is that? Uh, <laughs> guys won. <laughs> um, so Sean, obviously, he's got legs like no one else. Um, Tracy's honestly kind of scary just because her synthetic shirt. Um, <laughs> very intimidating. Um, and also, I mean, just watching that challenge, like, Katie was right on it too. And literally, I, as soon as I got to the table, I was like, there's three of us right here. Why aren't we, like, and I just asked straight up, I was like, can we work together? And Liam said, yeah. And I was like, fuck yeah, let's do this. Um, and then we just went row by row, number by number. And unfortunately, I fucked up one number, and um, and that was the last two, and that's why I'm not sitting with Faith. But I'm happy Elena has it, but I'm just upset with myself. Well, Sean, getting some deja vu, these three seemingly work together, so you wouldn't win immunity. And if I remember correctly, it was the final seven last year where six votes went your way and one went Katie's way, and Katie ended up going home because you had an idol. Right. Is this a similar situation to that, or is there more up in the air? I mean, the same thing happens. Every immunity challenge for me at this point is a must win. Like, I don't feel safe at all if I'm not holding immunity around my neck. Um, as to whether or not I have something in my back pocket. No. Katie, that must be one of the worst <laughs> feelings <laughs> in the world. <laughs> History repeats itself. Yeah. How, how have you adapted your game so something like that may not happen again. I think what I've observed at camp is that I think there's a pretty natural 4-3 split of who came in from past tribes and are clearly in a voting block together. And I just, if you're in a four and you're in this group, like you're probably the fourth. Like don't ever think that you are the safe one. Like every single person name is getting thrown around and if you want to get a vote from the jury you need to make a big move like picking off the bottom three is not going to get you votes so just keep that in mind luke assuming you were part of that four that you were part of the four of pierce that came into the merge mm -hmm. does that ring true does that ring any bells or sound any alarms for you what katie just said I spaced out to I kind of miss what Katie said. You want to summarize? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tracy, you're also part of that four. <laughs> Does that hold any water? Anything Katie just said? Or? Um, I think that a lot of the um, kind of talking that's going on between the different kind of groups of people um, is staying pretty solid. Um, there might be a couple that are flip flopping. And um, I think this vote will kind of reveal who those flip floppers are. Lexi, you came in as now part of the three of the seven. Was there any attempts to try to break people off or form new bonds of the seven that are here left? I mean, I think that those attempts have been going on since it was 6 5, and it's just a continuation of that. And I think that it's like, like, Everyone has said, I think, so many names. Everyone has heard every name. So it's just a question of who's doing what. All right, let's find out who's doing what. Tracy, you're up first. Did you 
with Sean. And right now, Sean's been voting with me really faithfully. Whether this is the best decision in this moment right now, I'm honestly not really sure. But I know Sean has been loyal up to now, so. I really hope that Sean, you're doing this. Katie, you're doing this. Lexi, you're doing this. It's time for a big move. Um, seven, it's crucial. And I think I've made my case to everyone. So hopefully people kick me around and this isn't my last vote. Katie said to make a big boom. Becca, you helped me win this necklace and now I'm voting you out. I think that's a pretty big move. And also, big moves come down to opportunity and timing. And right now is not the time to take out one of my three Alliance members. I'll go tally the votes. If anybody has a hidden immunity idol and like to use it, now would be the time to do so. If not, once the votes are read, the decision is final, and that person will be asked to leave the tribal council area immediately. I'll read the votes. First vote. Becca. Luke. One Luke, one Becca. Luke. That's two Luke, one Becca. Becca. Two votes Becca, two votes Luke. Becca. It's three Becca, two Luke. Fifth member of the jury, Becca. Becca, the tribe has spoken. Yeah, it was fun. It's gonna be fun to be on the jury, though. That's all I gotta say. It seems like the four stayed strong, added one to make it five, but what Katie said is true. There's only three seats here at the final tribal council, so grab your things, head back to camp. Put on your bathing suits before the next challenge. Really? <laughs> Stay tuned for scenes from our next episode. That sucked. Um... I kind of felt it coming. I knew it was either going to be Katie or I. I don't think Lexi had a chance of being voted on for that because she's easy to take to the end. Um, I mean, I think I played a very honest game as much as possible. Um, that was my game. It's just to spill it all, and I guess that didn't really work out. Um, but it'll be interesting to see like who helps each other out and who doesn't. Um, I was willing to help a lot of people out, I think. and people just were intimidated by my social game so yeah I mean right now Sean's looking like a good choice to to vote on um, but it's gonna be interesting to be on the jury next time on Survivor the castaways try and slide into the final five <laughs> the camp explodes as everyone makes a final push to get to the end well, now I'm nervous I shouldn't have said something